your party. Fuck your party. Hey, fuck your party and your party alone. I got a plumber, you won't see Luigi. Keep a squeegee, I can see me clear, but of course you was thinking Mr. Carter. Nah, I've been singing like his daughter name. Get that nigga never keep it that real busy. What's your story? How you like me now? Got to wipe me down. Even your moms think I'm clean. Who's the motherfucking hype beast now? Upper cuts to your grill on my George Foreman. <laughs> So we're finally getting to Mick Jenkins or more the, the frustration. frustration. We reviewed or more the anxious. The, these little mixtapes haven't been um, publicized by many media companies. No, unfortunately, I, I feel like he just he's just pretty much released them on the low. So if you're if a blog or a site is it knows Mick Jenkins, they put it up. But for those that don't really know him, with no exposure, they probably just skip it. It's not on Spotify be it due to copyright issues or not wanting to stream it, uh, The Anxious and The Frustration are on there. You can get them from mixtape sites for free. So Or SoundCloud. Or SoundCloud. Um, and here we are, reviewing uh, one of the best, man. One of the best doing it in Chicago right now. Yeah, like really like a, a top 10 artist for me right now. Mm. Um, and, I, and I put it all, all more The Anxious above The Healing Component. That's how much I love that tape. That tape was fucking beautiful. It's big, man. It's big props. Like production wise, of course. Production wise is amazing. We got an eight track mixtape EP, whatever you want to call it. We ain't going to skip a track this time, accidentally. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. A mixtape looks like something from like, like some guy that's put out his first mixtape. <laughs> Dope way to start, man. I love the verse. It was real cool. His wordplay was real smart on there. Super smooth. Real, real smooth, smart. Um, love the chill production. Drums were dope. It's a good first opener. Yeah, production suited the, the 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 lyric cadence perfectly. You okay with your knee there? Yeah, man. Sorry, sorry, man. Short and sweet, dope. Let's keep getting it. I got bitches, I got money, I got drugs, I got bitches, I got bitches, I got money, I got drugs. Yeah, that's all I have. Well, I got money too, and I got common sense. We all know niggas that got guns. I ain't gon' talk that shit, my nigga. I'm on Southside, period. Don't you you catch me out the traffic off the Mary J. Up in DJ Fairness, getting carried away. I carry trash on my situation, damn it, every day. Writing all my sentences with the city like I'm busy. If that nigga never keep it that real busy, what's your story? All our shit like I look glory. If you tell a nigga, tell me. Yes, I got bitches, I got bitches, I got money. I just find it interesting how even Mick Jenkins' voice can make I got bitches, I got money, I got drugs sound smooth. That is true. I thought he made it sound like much better than most other artists would make that sound. Was he meaning that though? No, he's sarcastic. It was like poker fun. Ah, so it's kind of the same as the, the song The Marty is. Like, I'm gonna get your money, yo. I'm gonna smoke my No, money. I feel like I take that as genuine. I interpret that as genuine. Because did you listen to the verse? He was like, he was like poking, like he then flipped it around and talked about how there's more important things to him. Hmm. No, I wasn't, I was pretty zoned out. Oh, that was, I, that was, I fully 99% sarcastic and kind of like. All right, well that. Because he said, that's all I hear. Right, that's all I hear. That's all he hears. Ah, right? Okay, okay. It's not him. You know. It's all he hears. I was hears. gonna say, I was surprised for a bit, but now it makes sense. Yeah. I want a yeah, yeah, 
catch me everything but pacifist Never doubt that, you ain't for cheese, you end up in mouse trash You running with leeches, you end up with couch rats The type of like your North Face, you end up coming about that Niggas lucky, I was never about that How high you like me now, got to wipe me down Even your moms think I'm clean, who's the motherfucking hype beast now? <laughs> Blowing bags on these bags just to feel myself, what? Yeah. Blowing bags on these bags just to feel myself. I had to do a shot rocking before Macklemore hit a nigga. Is that big? You fell asleep there towards the end, bro? Oh, I'm real tired. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm shit. I apologize for my sleepiness, but that was a real dope track. 100%. I love, the, I love the switch up. I love his, his flow in here. was like honey, man. He was just... Mm. And the first half was dope. Mm. First half was dope. I love how he mentioned the thrift shop Macklemore line and just cut straight to the next bit. Yeah. I fuck with that. He did this live at um in the, his Melbourne show uh in March yeah. um and when he was opening after the Underachievers and it was dope man. He did a lot of this from his mixtapes. So Did you like the Underachievers? Yeah, really They're did. Cool, they were their, their style is similar to Mick Jenkins. Very, I got it. Very like very uh chill. Kind of cloud wrapping away, very weed heavy. Oh, they went aggressive though live. For real? They were super aggressive. Ah, cool. Ah, cool. It's a dope track, man. Lyrically dense, very smooth. Um, again, Mick, this is what Mick does best is right here, exemplified on this track. But I will bag with my Gucci bag. FYP stands for. Fuck your position? Hmm. Maybe. Hey, fuck your party. Damn it. Oh, oh he did this too. Something better, your addition makes no difference to me. Got my woman, you can't better, don't got bitches with me. I'm like Papa, out this spinach, I need feta, I need cheddar. What I don't need is these niggas trying to whisper to me. Take the time of the place. I'm trying to catch me a vibe. They come you all in my face. Man, fuck your party. Fuck your party, 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 hey fuck your party and your party on my own shit. Ocean, I move with oceans, they know I swim good, I'm pulled up, this water potent, they know I sip good, I sit bad, I try to tip good, I'm growing, still loading, uploading, I might blow a whole zone in this motherfucker, I might blow a whole zone in this motherfucker, loud, I might blow a whole zone in this motherfucker, probably leaving early, I'm so grown, shit, and fuck your party, Fuck your party, hey fuck your party, and hey, fuck your party, yeah, your party, you want own shit. I'm gonna fuck my phone for cartoons and my shows at the school. Niggas out here tweaking just to win living with your phone, so I'm like, what? Take yourself. Yo, fuck your party. Yo, Yo fuck, fuck your party. party. Yo, fuck your party. No, I love that no. beat. That beat was probably the most, the anxious one so far. The most, the anxious one? Oh, oh anxious right, right, one. right. Because it was the most mellow. In a way, yeah, yeah. Repetitive. Like, I, I kind of like it, though. Druggy. It was real chill. Chill. Like your eyes right now. I'm struggling. Super chill. Take a, take a sleep, man. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to enjoy this fucking album. Chill the fuck out. Yeah, man. This, it, this album ain't no hype album. Did you like that song? Hell yeah. I mean, not as much as the other ones, but I enjoyed it, man. I liked it. You know, it's smooth. It's chill. It was hella smooth. So, fuck your party, man. Fuck your party. It, it, I like yeah. that track. Yeah, that track was dope. It didn't engage me as much as the other ones, but 
Yeah, I think the there's still track, elements. The third track's still the best one. We was on this class shit early. We was on that trip shit early. We respected women early. Had to learn a few things. We was dodging for this early. And I knew the law from early. And the strap was on me early. I was the first one with your balls. When I had that knowledge on me early. I knew violence from an early age. New dollars couldn't save me. Way more focused on the pearly gates. I'm pearly clumpy. Perforate y'all perpetrate more purposeful, more personal. This ain't for your person. Mama popped it, then smoked a quarter in my pocket. Three day bus passes, some patients, two, three bus downs at the house gone with my mama see. I promise we was on this fly shit early. We was on that drift shit early. We respected women early, had to learn a few things. Oh, oh. That got him up. That was fucking dope. That was a sick switch up. Hell I, yeah. I he don't usually do switch up to something like that. Nah, but it was real fucking dope. It went from like real chill to just like, like I said, I woke up, I paid attention. I was like, Whew. you know, I woke up out of a coma. But you notice, I don't know if you heard, real assertive. The verse was real assertive at the start. Really, really, really uh, uh, confident. Mm -hmm. And he, he did an alliteration so great where he just kept saying a word that started with P for like 10 bars in a row. Nice, and, like and P's and Q's. Yeah, he, he's so good at that stuff. He loves it. Yeah, I love when artists challenge themselves like that. It's real cool. It, it really inspires me. If I was going to make music, I would try and be as crafty as Mick. He's so crafty. I've, already, I've always told myself if I ever did make music, I would, it'd have to be something that was like challenging to me. Yeah. Why, why do it otherwise? Right. To stunt for the money? Fair enough. But if I was going to do it, I'd want to do it for like like the art just like the, yeah for the art to challenge myself like let's see how dope we can make this exactly that'd be the only way I could do shit I like that L sweatshirt type beat that was fucking dope yeah that was some I don't like shit I don't go outside one I still fuck with tight beats so let that shit breathe right there. I want people to think about that shit for a second it's something me Jenkins get up here uh -huh. Cook up some heat. Is that it? Yeah, man. No, I wanted more. That was so good. He did so well over that type of beat, Bro, man. Oh, that beat was fucking. Oh, I would dun, love a whole dun, album with that. Dun. Just moody beats, dark oh, beats, bruh. spooky beats, spooky beats, yeah. Spooky beats. Oh, hey, that's, that's spooky beats. Bro, it'll be a channel called Spooky Beats. That was fucking dope. That was real fucking cool. I was enjoying the he fuck out. He killed of that. that shit. That could be one of my favorites right there. You can play it again. Nah, man. Later. I just so happen to be a friendly guy. I get along with everybody, but at the same time, when the light comes on, I'm competitive with everybody. 
pigeonhole. Now I mean no, I'm different like I'm pigeonhole. Slew for this bull, nigga, no, this niggas know. No, we not the same, give a fuck about what you did before. You get the real me, twist your fingers if you figure deal me. I got the plumber, you won't see Luigi. Keep a squeegee, I can see me clearer. When I'm looking through a window, then I can in the mirror. Put in the fibra, gone in the pit. Can bring green thumbs deep in the garden. I'm watching for snakes, I'm watching for jakes. Murdered out, trust me, I ain't nobody you heard about. You niggas best believe I like to keep it that way. I know the fear's correct. Quick and niggas sheepish that way. I'm keeping that that niggas crazy, it's driving me crazy. I'm like, come on, let's go say see. I'm afraid to say, that's it. For that track. That was hard as fuck as well. Bro, he's killing these short ones. Man, I want to be longer though. That's good, it makes you want more, right? It does. That's a, that's a good or trait. More. The anxious, the frustration. That was a real cool track. The last two tracks have been fucking banging. I've switched it up from that chewiness. I love that, man. Flower boot in my Gucci bag. Actually, that's probably my least favorite track, actually. That one, that's my yeah. favorite. That's your favorite? I love that one. Yeah, see, it's super different. My least, one of my least favorite tracks right here. You didn't like it? I kind of liked it. I don't think Mick needs these types of features. I don't know. Like, I'm a bit mixed on this type of feature for him. Mm. Yeah, I feel like after his such a strong vocal display in this album, like... Yeah, I don't really think he didn't needs need it. Anyone. Like, if that was going to be there, why not make an EP with more features like that? So mm. it kind of is more... You know, feels good. <laughs> feels good. What feels I, uh, good? I uh, enjoyed The Anxious more than this tape, but this is still a good tape. Uh, oh, okay. I'm gonna flip you. I enjoy the frustration. I think more. Uh, it's it's clo it's not that close. It's not that far though. It's not that. I feel like you like you like bars more than production for Jenkins. Like I like production yeah. more for bars for Jenkins. I feel like when he fits a good beat, he fucking fits a good beat. Man. Like those last, like those those, those the, two spooky ones. Mm, they the Elsh one. They were so fucking sick. Yeah, he gets, He continues to prove why he has. He's one of the best wordplay lyricists. Um, in hip hop, outside of the big five, you know. Hundred percent. Who's your big five, bro? Well, that that's a whole another video, man. We got to keep wanting more. Kendrick, Drake. If you guys nope. J Cole. Nope. Kanye. Nope. None of those are in your top five. Nah, some of them are. It's, it's Jay Z, Kanye, Kendrick. But it depends. Drake, we doing J Cole? A, they're the big five. We doing the top five of all time. We doing the top five of current. Current, of course. Of course. They're the top five current. There's no argument. Like in culture wise. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's a different different question then. Mick Jenkins, you did your thing. I'm sorry I missed you, man. I should have come. You should have come, man. I should have come. He I did a lot of he, he did a lot of tracks from uh he, his last two mixtapes. These are oh, more mixtapes. Man, I fucked up. And then did another four from the other projects. Um. Anyway. Jungle Beats, Mick Jenkins, man, fuck with him. Fuck with Mick. One of the best out of Chicago. I'd love to see him work with some more artists and, and get some more shine, man. There he are definitely some it. people I'd love to see him work with. So uh, give me two. Give you two. Um, I'd like to see him do some more stuff with Alex Wiley. He's made music with him before. But yeah, they, I've they, seen that. They work so well together, like like MacGyver, one of the tracks they did this year. Who else? Um, I'll keep it Chicago. I'd definitely like to see him do a track with Kanye. I reckon with yeah. Kanye's production, he could definitely do a really good track with him. That'll take you to a whole new stratosphere. Mm-hmm. Uh, they're, they're two things I want to see more. Sky High. Mick Jenkins or more. Uh -huh. From Chicago, deep off in Pilsen with the Vatos. Mercy, mercy me, that mercy a lago. That seven hundred dollar jacket purchased from Barney's ain't hurt in my pockets. But fuck, what do I know? I'm really just a Southside nigga with a nice flow. Never been as passive as Rondo. I mean, hey, 